Welcome. In this video, we will see different ways of table creation in SAP HANA using SAP HANA Studio. With SAP HANA Studio, we can create tables in two ways. First, using SQL Editor. Second, using User Interface. There are two types of tables normally called as stores in SAP HANA, namely Column Store and Row Store. Column Store stores the data on column level. This is mostly suitable for HANA data models. If you replicate tables from source, by default, those will be replicated as column tables. As we all know, we get huge compression with columnar tables. So, typically OLAP or Online Analytical Processing Systems prefer column store. In row store, data is inserted in form of tuple. Each tuple is nothing but a row. The important advantage with row store is it works fast during addition, modification and deletion operations. So typically OLTP or Online Transaction Processing Systems prefer row store. During this video, I am going to create an employee table structure which will hold information of employees. Let's say this employee table has employee ID, employee name, joining date of employee and salary of employee as header fields. Open SQL Editor from either Quick Launch and select SQL Editor or right click on your schema and select SQL Editor or right click on your system and select SQL Editor. Let us start by creating an employee table as a row store. Now we will type the SQL statement in the SQL Editor. Create table, give it a name as employee1, in bracket type first field as EMP ID, data type integer, set it as primary key. Second field name, data type varchar, in bracket give value 10. Third field join date, data type date. Last salary, data type double. Here we are declaring EMP ID as primary key because employee ID contains unique values. Execute the SQL statement by either pressing F8 or click on this icon. Note that while typing the SQL statement, we did not mention anything about row or column store as by default it creates the table as row store. Now let's create one more table as column store. We will just edit this statement. Type column before table and change name to employee2. Rest everything will remain same. Execute the SQL statement which will create a column store table. Now right click on tables and click refresh. Now you can see both the row store and column store tables under the schema. You can also identify the table type from its respective icon. You can see that different icons are used to represent column and row stores. To view the content of the created table, right click on it and select open definition. This displays the table name, schema, type of the table and table structure. Now we will see how we can create table using user interface. Right click on schema, select new table. Give table name as emp underscore ui. If you want, you can change the schema through this drop down. By default, table type is column store. You can change it to row store by clicking on this drop down. Under heading name, type first entry as emp id. Change data type as integer. You can set this as primary key by clicking in this field. Similarly, enter other data like name, join date and salary and select respective data types. Finally, click on execute. Thus, we have created column store table structure emp underscore ui using user interface. So, in this session, we have seen how to create row store and column store through SQL editor and user interface using SAP HANA Studio. Thank you.